The attack came without any warning at 9.35 and it was a lucky fluke shot which killed Constable Keyes. The raiders, four or five of them, had made their way down to an old railway bridge which crosses the river here which forms the border. The police station itself is practically on the edge of the river and so the distance for the shot was only about 70 or 80 yards. Constable Keyes was just going off duty. He was walking up the stairs when the projectile, it's not yet clear just what sort it was, was fired by the men. It passed through a steel shutter, passed right through the constable, through a wall, and landed up in one of the front rooms of the police station. An army sergeant, Sergeant Robert Coser, told me what he saw. We had just passed each other on the stairs, and uh, he, he was going up at that time. What happened then? There was an almighty bang and the window came in and uh, the constable's body was thrown straight down past me to the foot of the stairs. After that then you dashed out. Could you see where the attack had come from? Yes, we, we, uh, not pinpointing it definitely, but we could see the general area, which was quite close to the station, to the rear of it. Yes, were they in the woods or were they out on the old railway bridge? Uh, they were fighting uh, from a concealed cover. So, you opened fire on them. How many shots were exchanged, do you think? Um, I don't know at this stage. How long did the battle last? Approximately 25 minutes. Were there any hits observed at all on the attackers? Uh, not, nothing definite at all, no. And then after that, they just, uh, the firing presumably died away? It did. Would you like to speak to the girl?